Hi, this is Christine with Digital Come Up. I am going to teach you how to make a post carousel that will publish all of your latest articles right to your homepage as soon as you publish them. So to do this, you'll need two plugins, both of them by site origin, the page builder plugin and post carousel. So to show you what these look like, I'm just going to take you to the plugins page where you can add new plugins. And I'm just going to search for site origin. And you really, you don't need page builder to do this. Um, I'm just going to show you how to use page builder in this tutorial because that's how I, um, that's how I designed it on this website. So the two you'll need to put that post carousel up on your website are Page Builder by Site Origin, which is right here, and Site Origin Widgets Bundle, which is right here, and the post carousel widget is in this bundle. So go ahead and install both of these, um, and then make sure you activate both of them. You'll be prompted to activate it after um, they are installed. And the Page Builder one will be ready to go. Uh, the Site Origin Widgets Bundle you might just want to check one thing with that. So under your plugins, you know, after that's activated, you'll go down to Site Origin Widgets. And um, this is the bundle. This is everything you get. But you really want to make sure the post carousel is turned on um, before you try to build your carousel. So once that's turned on and all your plugins are ready to go, you can make a new page. And I'm just going to show you, you know, how I made my news carousel, so it'll be an exact replica of the one that's on my home page. So now that I'm on the page builder, I'm going to choose the page builder layout, and I'm going to add a widget. And scrolling down to my site origin widgets, I'm going to choose site origin post carousel. Then once it's displayed in the page builder, you can edit it. So you can call it whatever you like. I'm going to call mine news since it's displaying all of my news posts. And then you can kind of customize what posts you actually want to show up in your carousel. And they don't have to be posts. They could be other media. They could be pages. They could be replies. Um, so you have some, some choice there. You could select posts. Um, if you do this, though, they won't automatically update. So I'm not going to do that. I am not going to worry about the taxonomies either. And I'm going to order it by publish date so that it shows the uh, most recent posts first. But you can also, um, you know, there's a bunch of different choices and you could choose to do it however you like. Post per page, I'm going to choose three. That's what I have on my home page. That just um, tells it to show how many to show before the user has to, you know, scroll to the right to see more. Um, an additional, this is how I make mine automatically updating. I say cat equals three, and that just tells it to pull in all of the category three posts, which happen to be my news posts. So every time I publish a new post with, within my news category, those will be added automatically to the carousel that's on my homepage, which is really great. It, um, you know, it makes sure your homepage is always up to date. It's really saves you time and it's important so your visitors are never seeing out-of-date content. So once you have everything you want set up, you can click uh, Save and then you'll be able to preview how your carousel looks. And this looks good to me. This looks exactly the same as my home page carousel. So I am going to click Done. And then, you know, you can preview it before you publish your post or your page in this case. And voila, there it is. Um, it looks, as I said, exactly the same as my home page, which uh, I can show you again as further proof if you don't remember. Yeah, so it's a pretty simple process if you have those two plugins. Again, that was Page Builder and Post Carousel, both site origin plugins. Um, Definitely recommend downloading them and adding a feature like this to your homepage or any other page or post on your website or blog. Thank you so much for watching. This has been a Digital Come Up tutorial.